Morning. It's looking a nice day. The cows are happy. The dogs are happy. Everybody's happy. I am aching a bit from yesterday. The dog keeps licking me. Um, yeah, I'm making it a lot. Uh, what, a, what a day. Um, but today we're going to be on making hay. That's the thing. Not, not fully woken up yet, but we'll get there. We'll get there. We got some concrete inspection going on here. My dad was pouring water on it all last night. That's what the blue pipe's out for. In the lorry again. Nice. It's early as well, it's seven o'clock. We don't normally come in this early and we don't normally work as late as we did last night, so. Yeah, it's looking all right. Found the most ridiculous thing in his pocket. What is it, Andy? What have you fetched today in your pocket? <laughs> The anticipation, guys, the yeah. anticipation. I, see, I seen you getting a bit hot with your hair yesterday, so I brought you a hairband. Hairband in Andy's pocket. <laughs> hey, you guys, you're all looking nice in the field this morning. Hedges are growing up, though, aren't they? It's getting dearer and dearer here. No, people are going on with this job. People don't have money, do they, to, uh, to make an extra 30 and 40 quid a tank? That's what we've got to. Yep, yeah, fuel prices are crazy at the minute. But, anyway, we've got Emmy here doing the mix. Looks like Andy's still got some strawing to do, so I don't know what they've been doing this morning. Must have been kept busy with something. I guess it's a bit more difficult with uh, with the yard being concreted. We've not got all that space that we we've been accustomed to. It's coffee time. A red hot bath. You got a red hot bath. Oh, Go on then. I'm not on my bath right now. I'm going quite easy. I have to get my bath. There's no water in it. What is this? Because of your sunburn? Yeah. It's hurting. It's alright though. You have to sun on. Sure we didn't have enough to put sure on it. Does that work? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> it were a cream anyway. It was either that or a pint of milk. Yeah. <laughs> hmm. I don't know. Now informing us. If there's it to come to rub gel on his arm. He's, he's, he's been, went to buy a dress the other day. He's got a bobble in his pocket. Now he's telling us you're buying 80 pound cosmetics to rub into his arms. <laughs> hey! <laughs> <laughs> We're turning Andy into someone that he's not, are you, aren't we? <laughs> <laughs> Morning! Could do with a bit of advice, guys. We've got an old special washer that we keep fixing and fixing and fixing and fixing, and it's got to a point now where it's like, right, let's just get a new one. But we want one that's like static, that we can just bolt to the floor in here somewhere and forget about. But what do people recommend? What's a good brand? Um, yeah, basically that's what I'm looking for. Recommendations. Let us know. Cheers, guys. Have a great day. Don't use any names then, but like the way you just explained that is like... That ginger one. That ginger one is this, a girl. This guy called Joe, who was a boy, and it that person's their sister. Right. The ginger one, sister. the ginger one is a girl, right? Right. And Joe is their brother, but it's a ginger one's sister. Oh my god. What? The brother and sister, one's ginger, one's brown, one's called Joe. <laughs> and is Joe a boy or a girl? Joe's a boy. He's right. brown. He's got brown hair even. Right. And then the other one's a girl with ginger hair. Alright. Yeah, understand? No, no, all but anyway. So we've just got some out to go to first market. And Em's eager beaver, she's reading the uh, numbers for us, but I just need to get my phone opened up onto a message so I can write them down. Business? Okay. Hail Em, it's in my way. Oh, put it there. I'm guessing it's either you or my dad. What? That bail. 
my dad. Yeah, he likes putting stuff in where. Anyway, Andy's shifting that. I'm going to be going off to Thirsk Market with some cattle. Never done that before, eh? What? It's a world first from here. What? Taking some cattle to market. Was it? Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Well, I've done that. Have you? Not a drug, but you know. Not nearly. Well, not been many here. So I'm here. I'll get these guys unloaded and uh, maybe get something to eat, I think. A nice uh, lorry there. Got some sheep in. It's busy. Some big kit. I'm guessing that's like a training centre or something. For the big dumpers and the diggers. Hey, it's looking busy in here. Sandwich, drink to take away, four pound, bish bash bosh. Um, I um, probably would have ate it in there, but we've got here to make, haven't we? So I better get back home and then we'll be straight on to uh, making some here. Got some nice tractors in here 155R, a Massey, Andy would be happy, and a case. And a Scania. I'm going to jump in. A hot Scania. No aircon Scania. Got back into the yard and everything's busy. Andy's up there on the top of the clamp, sorting the silage out. We've got the mixer here. And then we've got the Mickey here as well. This is John Deere, rear of his bailer. Ready to go. Business. We've got the 7530 Beast ready to go and fetch some hair. I'll get the spikes on this in a second. And then we're ready to pick some up. So I'll go, go, go. I'm just waiting for Andy to come back with that uh, load of hay. I thought, what can I do? Not a great deal, apart from digging. I'm in the digger. Yes, I'm on it. Digging a big hole out of some more concrete so we can get some more poured in. Hopefully tomorrow, maybe, possibly. Well, there's a bit of a hole starting. But Andy's here. I'm not sure what's happening though, because there should be another row on top of there. What's happened to the top? What happened to the top? Top? Yeah? The top. I it was in the one field. Oh, is it? Oh, yeah. oh right, yeah, 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 It's a little field. Well, the builders have nicked my TM. Um, so I'm on this nine meter to start off with. Uh, yeah. Oh, ah, well, okay. Just not got great air con, that's all. These two are just maxing and relaxing in the sun. You all right, guys? Hey? Can't remember if you're the one that's not as friendly as the other. I think you are. Them flies are on you a bit though, aren't they? Hey? Eh? Lovely, lovely job, eh? We'll just do with some rain for your grass though, couldn't we? Oh, this rain on the wind is not so good. When we've still got another field to bail. Be all right if we if they are bailed, um, or if it's just a light shower. But hmm, might end up having to stack some outside. Just jumped on the nine meter to move some of the burnt posts out of the way for the builders, so I can have it back and feed my cows. It's tipped off here. So me and Andy have just got the feeding done. Um, we're going to head back to the field on the seven five thirty. Pick up the second to last load, fetch M back, and then Andy will get the last 14 bales on. Yeah. These guys will need feeding, Emily. I'll tell Emily though, there's no point of watching this video to find out that they need feeding. Is there really? Because then they'd be hungry, wouldn't they? <laughs> Anyways. <laughs> Riding shotgun with Andy now. On the way to the field, see ya. Me and Andy now going down the real tight lane. There's abuse on this old machine. Oh, it's horrible, isn't it? Andy, have you run over the mall? It feels pretty soft. Why? Looks nice that sky, you know. Does not camera anyway. Yeah. When it was raining. So M's got these loaded up. 
and we'll get back, headed back to the farm. Sorting me out brakes and electrics. Business. Andy's just going to get those last few bales that are over there. That's the plan. So Mick's back in the yard. He's just dropped off a massive bale. Big bale. As big as it'll go. Get my JCB out, start stacking, and we'll get wrapping the straps up, and then hopefully Andy will be back anytime soonish. I think this is probably where I'm going to end it tonight. Huh? Yeah. So if you've liked it, please press that like button. Subscribe if you've not already, because we're near that near that really great number where we get um, takeaway and beers. Oh, it's getting close to it. Em. Is it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh. So, um, yeah, if you've done that, please like and all that business. And we will see you tomorrow. You're here tomorrow, aren't you? I'm definitely Yeah, tomorrow. business. Bye! Mix off! Oh, I think he is. Oh, no! He just wants to be on camera, he says! <laughs> Are we going to get him? Fall down this time, I'm going to get some stick up rage. <laughs> so, yeah. See, you see ya, cheers, mate. Bye. I said to him, Andy, I said, if they fall down, I'm blaming you. <laughs> <laughs> uh, oh, if anybody wants a hat or t shirt, joeseals.com. Thanks for watching, guys. See ya. Bye. I said bye this time, Andy. Yeah. See? <laughs> so. I've got all those hay bales stacked away in the shed now. I've put the nine meter away tractors and TMs away but we got one last thing to do make some mentions in aid of the air ambulance if people want to get involved in this check out the link below um, we're raising money for the air ambulance which is a fantastic cause today it is for Liam Williams he's the man on the mix of mention he's finished school today and he's starting an apprenticeship at Farmstar so and it's our local one so you might get to come here and see us Business. I hope not though, because I don't want any of our machines to break down. So I hope that's not the case. <laughs> right. Bye guys. Thanks for watching. See you tomorrow.